First here at six, a historic day in the fight against COVID-19. The first vaccines have arrived in Charlotte and they're already being administered. These are photos of employees at Atrium Health receiving the first shipment today. The hospital in Dilworth, the first in the state to administer the vaccine. The first dose is going to health care workers who are at high risk of exposure to the virus. Governor Roy Cooper marking the moment with these words today on social media, calling it a remarkable achievement for science and health, reminding everyone to keep wearing a mask while we get as many people vaccinated as quickly as we can. WCNC Charlotte's Alex Shabbat is tracking all of the vaccine developments for us this evening. He joins us live with the latest. Alex. Well, Fred Atrium Health started vaccinating people shortly after receiving the shipments this morning, including the very first person in North Carolina to get it done. Within a day of the planes taking off, Atrium Health announcing this morning the COVID-19 vaccines are here and Dr. Katie Passaretti making history in North Carolina. So I just got my first COVID vaccine. As the first person in the state to receive the vaccine. I feel perfectly fine. I've had no issues with the vaccine. As of 2.30 this afternoon, Atrium Health says they had vaccinated five employees. Dr. Gary Little, who's been organizing the distribution, says the shipments arrived about an hour early. Things went off without a hitch. They, they are now in our uh, freezer. You know, we processed a few people this morning, again, just to kind of get used to the, you know, the thawing of the, the vaccine. We first reported Atrium Health was among 11 medical providers in the state to get early shipments from Pfizer because they have ultra cold storage space for the vaccines. Caldwell Memorial Hospital, which is also on the list, says they plan to vaccinate staff on Wednesday, and dozens of other hospitals received their first week of allocations in the coming days. The number of doses ranging from 975 per hospital to more than 2,900 based on bed capacity, health care workers, and county population. And we have upwards of enough capacity to store uh, around 300,000 doses of the vaccine. Frontline healthcare workers are the first to have access to the vaccine and employees can now enroll to get one. Just a moment of hope, a moment of like potential for change of the course that we're on with the pandemic right now. I would just encourage everyone to consider getting vaccinated, talk to your doctor, get educated. And South Carolina state health officials did not release an early shipment list, citing security concerns. Live at Atrium Health, Alex Shabad, WCNC Charlotte.